it doesn't get better. Once you let a kid get away with something, listen, my daughter said today uh, at the UPS store, she said, I just want to, oh, shit. But she said, shoot. And I said, what the fuck? You? Like, I'm always on her, and I'm keen on respect. Mm -hmm. and, and I don't want... To the point that you'll disrespect? Yeah. Well, then you ain't no respect. Because if you don't respect... I feel like respect, I, I'm her elder. Matter. I'm her elder. Don't matter. I'm her elder. That I don't have to give her... Green Listen, light. I'm going to tell you like Denzel Washington said on, on, on that one movie. He said, what, what gives you the right to think that I got to like you? You got a roof over your head? You talking you about got yeah. yeah, when he Love said that, that was very. That was, it was real. real. It was, it was real. very but, real. But was that you disrespectful? Saying, was what he said disrespectful on on, on uh, the film? Was, no, hell no. That's what I'm saying. Like, but but I was just about to piggyback off. Okay, go ahead. You, the way he putting it, you don't know their relationship, right? Mm -hmm. So if I could talk to you a certain way, you know I take care of you. You know, I, I know you got unconditional love for me. You know, I got unconditional love Facts, for you. Facts, right? Like, I'm not going to let nothing happen to you. Facts. Like, okay. I'm breathing on earth. Right. My job is to protect you and provide, and that's what I'm doing. I'm going to do that. Right. And you should know this. Mm -hmm. The moment, if I gave you a reason to think otherwise at Facts. any time and never came and corrected it, that's on me. I appreciate you for that, King. Yeah, that, that's that's, that's deep. Look. What he said. I, I that's what that's really what I'm saying. But but you no, you be in the antagonist. No, no, I'm just asking are. because listen. No, no, he, he bring it down. So I'm saying me because I see it a lot of times. That's the same way. For example, if I'm in my room and my son is in his room, you know what I'm saying, and he's talking to his friend, and he's like, "Oh man, fuck that nigga." I'm not one of the parents on me. Oh. No, because it's not intentional. You know what I'm saying? Why would I bring? And, you know that. and, and I it's know it's not intentional. You know what I'm so saying? So they don't do it in your face. The same wavelength. It, listen, it depends on even that same way. Like a lump, me and my mom was watching a uh, raw deal with Arnold Schwarzenegger, right? And so <laughs> they fighting. I get excited. I'm like, kick that motherfucker out. You know what I'm saying? I'm like. Six, seven years old, you know what I'm saying? My mom started laughing because it, it wasn't, I, I didn't even attend no, no disrespect. All right, so I just asked you the question and I want you to answer it correctly, not not dance around the motherfucking question. I answered it. Is it disrespectful for them no. to cuss in front of you? No, depending on what they're doing. I, I feel like so cursing. If somebody's playing the game and they go, oh, <coughs> shit. I feel like cursing comes with age limit. It's wow. It's different. Like, but, like, for example, me. I never thought I would be, man, I cussed like a sailor around my daddy. But mm -hmm. I also earned that respect. How? You know, because How? I waited till I was, like, 35 to do this shit. But if you know it's wrong, it's wrong. What difference right. does the age? age? If it's disrespectful, That's disrespectful. It's not. It's not. If, if, if me and, well, then, it's so dead. No, my, me and my it, dad it, talk it amongst each other. 10. Me and my dad talks among each other as men. There's a difference. At one point in time, I was you just a little boy and I was just a child. You couldn't talk that way. Both your language really don't mean men, though. But... I'm, I'm a man, and he okay. treats me like a man. He, he he don't pay my bills. I don't pay his. We we, we put our shoes on the same way. The only difference so, is so, so so you go ahead, go ahead, go The only ahead, difference ahead, is go ahead, go ahead. that if my dad ever felt disrespected, I would stop. Right. That that's the thing. The the respect is he allows me to. How can oh, so? My, my question is this. If you think that is wrong, Rodrigo, why does building. somebody have to say hey? You shouldn't do that. So that's just like I have. Ne I probably I have cussed around my mom, but when they have, it would have to be an absolute, totally fucking accident. I never sat around my mom and, and with my brothers and my sisters and doing and fuck this. Never none none of that. Even if I accidentally cussed, well, I say my bad to my mom to this day. Oh, uh, you know it's saying? always yes sir, no man with me. But I'm, me and I'm, my dad, I'm talking about cussing. All and right, so, but I'm saying me and my dad, I, I we created a rapport. Wrong, we created a rapport just being around each other every Sunday. Everybody know my routine. Me and my dad created a rapport to where we're like friends, but he's still my father. You understand? Like, we shooting the shit. Do you think like, cussing is wrong? Do you think no, kids should cuss around no, their parents? No, But my son is 21 years old, and my son won't cuss in front of me. And you know what I like about that? Is he respects me enough not to. But he's going to get to an age... To where it's gonna be some motherfuckers shit, goddamn, and they're well, now, Say so. Say you found your son upset at a situation, and he cussed, and he's cussing out of anger. I would, would understand you that. And, so you under, so you wouldn't be sitting there talking about. Uh, 
Hold on. No. Don't do that in No, it's a respect to it, dog. Like, like but so you know, it's, it's, so it's, it's know a gray area. And the, the conversation we're having is no white and black. It's a gray area. I'm saying it's definitely situational, for sure. For sure. But but once you wake it up, like, God damn, motherfucker. Like, no. Like, but if you bump your knee, fuck. That's different. It's a different. It's, right. it's a gray that's area. What I, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So then, my thing is, is that a lot of times... People be big on this respect shit to the point to where they disrespect. Yolanda says Especially. she cuss like she cuss hell everybody in my family curse. Uh, yeah, but like I said, I didn't start cursing until I built the rapport with my father. My father and them every Sunday hangs out and just talk shit, shoot the shit. Eventually, my son is only 21 years old. Mm -hmm. He's just now getting that age to where I want him to start coming over. I want him to be a, Now you get to see what it's like to be a real man around real men and have this conversation. I, he's almost there. He's just... I, I'm inviting him now. I'm like, son, you should come. In. He's 21. He can now drink around us. We can now hang out. We can now shoot the shit. See, I don't, but see that, like, I don't want that. I don't want to hang out with my kids. Period. That's weird. Especially drinking, especially doing anything. But that's respect. because that ain't weird. If you don't, if that part, that. Not that you don't want to hang out with your kids? No, you didn't hear what he said at the end. I believe it's the end part. Anyway. Right. Yeah, you know because saying? I hang out with my kids every day. They live with me. I'm around them 24 7. I can't get rid of them. And so, but I'm talking about no. as far as drinking, no. drinking smoking, oh, no, no, kicking no. it. I, I feel like, like me, I'm, like me going. I, I want to see my son. First off, I feel like sometimes, especially with people that don't drink alcohol, I, I feel like it puts them in an emotional state. And, it, and you it, say that don't or do? It does, and it puts them in a state to where they can be vulnerable and be themselves. I really believe when a person drinks, because I'm I'm living proof of that. That's when I'm the most vulnerable. That's when my tongue is just authentic as fuck. I'm always you authentic aware of and real, huh? Are you aware of it? Am I aware of it? Yeah, yeah. But and, and so I, I just know when I drink, I might slip up and say some you're shit. You're aware of it. It's a strength, and you're using it to your strength, and you're using alcohol. To say what you uh, want to say. Let's stop making about alcohol. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> yeah. I, with my son, I want to be able to have a drink with him yeah. so he can be like, Dad, man, I wish you would have, you know, like, yeah, yeah, some yeah. shit, because my yeah, son is a, he's a I'm fucking gonna, tight say, ass. So, if my son was 35 and I was, you know, I'm still, you know, bless me, I'm still living. Mm -hmm. I would have a drink with him. Yeah, you know yeah. Saying? And smoke some meat like you like to do. If I don't want to smoke, I'm not smoking at that point. I'm, I'm talking smoking meat. What the fuck you mean you smoke meat? Uh, <laughs> you said you like to smoke meat. <laughs> <laughs> you said you like smoking meat. You said you like to smoke meat. He didn't yeah, want you to get the red. You man. like to throw down the red. <laughs> yeah. Now imagine this. All right, so. so you talking, talking about me being a chef in real yeah, life. Yeah, so imagine this. Wanting your son to pull up, pop, throwing something on the grill, you and your son having a couple beers. That's fucking gold. Man, fuck that. Nigga, by that time, that's the two. At the hottest podcast in the city, the smartest dumb people. I'm here with my nigga, that dude Johnson. You know what I'm saying? We go way back like four flats on the Cadillac. Y'all tune in every week or every time. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Do what you're supposed to do. Like, comment, share. Tell your people about it. Y'all know what it is. It's the smartest dumb people. See, man, when you get that type of Because he literally sing with other people. So, like, this is the story. This is the best podcast in the city. Of Thank Ohio. you. Yeah, yeah. I'm not pandering. You know what I'm saying? And they take vocals and, you know, script and they start living on some hustle. And you're a real hustler, huh? That's, that's pretty neat. Uh, uh, into it. But, uh, I also, uh, met the team. She, they know she likes to go outside and play soccer by herself. We have to uh, see
this is the coldest fucking thing that's going on. Right. Well, these are the realest niggas out there. Yeah, you already know. Like, for real. Yeah. Like, this is God. I go off the mentality of the woman. And I know if I, if I know my woman. Let's go!